Hello everyone, this is Jeff of Tau Flater Mouse. Today we're going to put peanut butter in a sealed test tube and superheat it. The ingredients of this peanut butter are peanuts, sugar, palm oil, and contains 2% or less of salt, and then molasses is the last ingredient. So what we're doing here is converting the heat from the flame into potential energy. It's kind of like compressing a spring to the point where something just finally gives. The glass test tube can only withstand so much pressure, so either the glass will break or rupture, or the plug will blow out. The peanut butter is building up a lot of heat, several hundred degrees. It can't vaporize because it's in a sealed container. When the pressure is suddenly released and everything goes back to atmospheric pressure, then the contents will want to flash and expand and vaporize. So we're going to speed up the video footage, get past the boring part. Uh, the overall time from heating until failure is only about two minutes. The black color you see is the peanut butter inside the test tube burning. As we've seen in other test tube videos, that's kind of a sign that we don't have very good heat transfer. However, the glass didn't rupture this time, so at least we had a normal plug blowout. What's unusual about this experiment is it actually stayed in the wire holder. It had enough energy to flip and bend the wire 180 degrees though. We put 30 milliliters of peanut butter inside this test tube and most of the contents just blew out the top when it finally blew. It wasn't as an energetic uh, reaction as in past videos, typically water-based uh, materials have a much higher expansion rate than oil base and that was definitely the case in this test. I hope you enjoyed this unusual experiment. Thanks for watching.